If you watched the catering sales funnel video, you already know the importance of putting all qualified prospects and customers into your database. I'm going to show you how to do that today through the CRM, or the Customer Relationship Manager. So you'll go to the CRM tab at the top. On the left, there's the option to add new contact. Once there, there'll be the customer information to put in. So we'll have a first name, their last name, their company name, and then we'll put them in a group. So maybe they're a church or a corporation. In this case, they're a school. You can put in their email, their phone number, their address. And once all the information is put in, you'll go to save contact at the bottom right. Let's say you want to search for this contact at a later time. On the left, go to contact list. You'll see an option to search and you'll type in the customer name. You also have the option to set a to do for the customer, which will remind you to do something on your calendar. Go to the third icon from the left. It will say to do's. If you click on that, you'll see an option to create a to do for the customer. First, you'll assign who handles this to do. You'll schedule it for a specific date and a time. And then you'll classify what type of activity this to do is for. So it could be a generic activity, an event, a meeting. In this case, we'll say it's a telephone call. And if you go down, you can put in a display name and a description. So we'll call this a telephone call with Jane Doe. And in the description, we'll say what this is for. Call back Jane Doe for catering order. When you're done, you'll go to the bottom right corner and press Save Activity. Once saved, the activity will be put on the calendar under the customer name. You'll scroll down to the date, click on the name, and the calendar will show the date, the time, and the description of the activity. Next time, we'll go through how to create a catering quote using our software.